Hello everyone, welcome to our new video series. This is Cooking with the Men's Domain. Um, this first few videos are just going to be on basic cooking techniques. If you read the latest surveys and research, cooking is becoming a perishable skill. Most Gen Yers, both men and women, can't cook. So what this series is designed to do is to give you a basic grounding in cooking techniques and knowledge of flavours. All of these are one pot meals, for the most part, which basically means all the cooking is done in one pot. There's no need for multiple pans, pots, that sort of thing. All in the one pot, straight to your plate. Today we're going to start with a basic bolognese sauce. And a bolognese sauce you can use for obviously spaghetti bolognese, you can turn it into a savoury mince, you can use it for lasagna, or you can use it for meatballs. So, these are the ingredients we need. We have a whole chopped onion, mushrooms, these are optional, bacon, this is optional, it's left over from this morning, so I'm throwing it in, handful of basil, olive oil, chopped tomatoes, some red wine, pork and veal mince, and beef mince. Normally lasagna you use pork and veal mince only, but we're changing it up a little bit today. Salt and pepper, olives, again, these aren't necessary, garlic, and anchovies. You're probably wondering what they're all about. We're going to go into that right now. So, going to turn our pan on, a little bit of oil. Now, the reason we put anchovies in a lasagna is because it gives it a, a base of flavor. Now, you're probably thinking of your typical anchovies on pizza and you're thinking, wow, that's disgusting. I don't want anchovies in my lasagna. Well, it works a little differently with a lasagna because you're not having these huge, great big anchovies in there. The whole point is we disintegrate them. They're quite, um, they're quite fragile. You don't need to chop them up. All you do, if you can see in the pan here, is break them up with a wooden spoon as the pan's heating up. And what that means is you won't taste any anchovy at all in your lasagna. All it will do is give you lasagna, as I said, a base of flavor. It means you don't have to add salt all the time because you're gonna have a base note of saltiness and it'll give it a bit of extra body as well. So, yeah, kind of broken up, but they'll disintegrate further on their own. So, next thing we add, onions. Now, a lot of traditional Italian recipes will tell you a lasagna needs onions, carrot, and celery. If you like carrot and celery, go for your life, throw them in. I hate them in lasagna, so I'm not putting them in. Now, we don't want the pan too hot on a medium heat because we're just going to sweat these onions down, and that means they're going to turn translucent and further break up this anchovy. 